Hey guys, Kenny with Ugly Tent. I'm at camp today and I got a little project I want to share with you. We're going to do a um, bed roll, not a bed roll, a uh, sleeping pad with the Tyvex or the, the house cover. You know, I'm a contractor so I have access to this, but you know, if you're passing by a job site, there's usually scraps of this that they'll give you. You just ask the contractors, they'll give you a little piece of the house covering or Tyvek. We got some reflectix and duct tape. So we're gonna make us a sleeping bed. Stay tuned. All right, let's lay it out and see what we got. It's not a very big piece. It's very, it's gonna be a torso pad, but for what I'm using it for, like a uh, little nap mat or something like that, this would be perfect. Or if you got an ultralight hiker out there, backpacker, this is good stuff. This is Tyvek, it's waterproof. Got a few holes in it here and there, but you know, it's okay. Going work just fine. 16 wide. Uh, that would probably most of your pads, your sleep pads, are like 20 inches wide. So this is just going to be. Let's just do it. Let's just do one, and we might do another piece to it. And then we'll come to here. I'm just going to use all the tie back I've got here. I'll allow myself a little bit to So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to allow myself a little bit to fold over. So I'm going to cut it short about right here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 20 inches wide, so we're gonna end up four inches to this thing. Mark it 20. Let's do 25. So I marked it 20 and it looked a little too small, so I'm going to go 25. That'd be perfect. Don't throw this away because this makes a perfect material for a koozie or a, a uh, <clears throat> little warming um, envelope for your dehydrated food. It's going to use for all kinds of stuff. Now that we've got it all laid out, we're just going to cut around it. We're allowing ourselves a couple inches to fold over. It's going to have to be perfect because you're going to fold it and then tape it down. My scissors aren't working that good so we're gonna break out the sack and see how we do gets it like butter
Okay, now I'm just going to fold these seams over and duct tape them. I think I'm going to tack it down first. Same thing here. Just gonna tack it down a little bit. So, it's looking good, but I'm going to reinforce these outside corners, make them a little better. And there we go. There's our, there's our uh, Tyvek and duct tape sleep pad. Rolls up real nice. Insulated. Nice little ground barrier. Uh, I'm going to weigh this when I get home, but I mean, this is like maybe eight ounces. I mean, super light. But durable, reflective. All kinds of good stuff you can use this. Let's put it to the test. So this thing would make a, also make a nice supplement to your pad. Like if you've got a nice air mattress that you don't want to get punctured, Put this down first, put your air mattress on it, and this will help protect your high dollar air mattress. Also, you don't have to roll it, you can fold it. And it folds just as easy as it rolls. Fold it up, put it in your pack. Easy to store. So thanks for watching, hope this video was helpful and uh, give you some ideas for some gear for your journeys. See you next time.